All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Top Price. And we got some work to do because <coughs> first we need to cough a little bit. <coughs> no, um, I got a couple new ultra rares. I maxed them out, and they're very interesting. They could be one of the fastest ones around there, and I want to test today on a quarter, on a half, and on a full mile which ultra rare is performing the best from my selection so in order to do this we can go just here into campaign usa and then we go into round number five what car for what distance that is the question that is the question which we're going to answer now and so um to check out my ultra rest here you go and to give a little bit background information so i got the new ultra rare i got is for example the 650i convertible which is a German Renaissance car and I just maxed it out just to show you a little bit engine and weight that's where I went for. Another one which not so many people like but I really enjoy it because it many people are using it is the SL73. Again engine and max, engine and weight. Then we got the SLK Black Series. Um, not from the German Renaissance, however, I just got it and engine and weight as well for this one. Same for the Tuscan convertible, which I had for such a long time. <laughs> I never used it, I never maxed it out because I'm always waiting for the Tamara. The Tamara is one of the fastest and best ultra rares out there regarding speed. Uh, however, I don't have it, but if you have it, please keep it. Don't do the same mistake I did and fuse it. Um, and so I'm actually not, not taking the Tuscan convertible because this one is out of question. This one is one of the fastest ones around there. Only the Tamara can really beat it. Then we got a roof car, uh, an ultra rare, the 22 RQ1, which is a very fast one as well. However, I don't have this one, but if you have, if you have those, you can drop in the numbers as well. But so which one should we take? We got a 3.6, 3.6, 3.6, and we got here a 3.7. And I think to make it complete, we would take the SLC. 43 which has a 37 as well however this one has a different upgrade as you can see we could have gone for um for uh, probably for an engine and weight but i really like that man that uh, that handling so um so and here i went for the other one because it has a good good of top speed 186 and here we go this one goes this way okay however let's go quarter mile where should we start with mm, let's go with the s55 on a quarter mile then we will drop on half mile the good old sl73 and an old timer the slc43 the rest doesn't matter much but let's see quarter mile for the s55 we're going in we're locking in a time of ladies and gentlemen 11 1183 is definitely a very good time and you should keep that in mind. 1183 for the S55. Half mile. We're going in. You see, I mean, the mid range is not amazing. However, we got 1923 for this one. And now we go in a full mile for the SLC. Coming in with a 32. So, okay, good. So we got our first three. Anything surprising there so far? I don't know. I don't really think so. So next we're going in. Let's see. Um, I say, I say we go and drop this one. This time, the SL73 goes on the quarter mile. I say the SL, uh, the SLC will go on a half mile and the s55 will go on a full and let's see all right quarter mile hmm that will be interesting can the sl73 beat the s55 on a quarter mile i pretty much don't think so i pretty much don't think though even though we see a 0 to 60 time from 3.6 that's faster than 3.7 and I don't know why the freaking he is doing such a long time now. Come on, guys. You don't even need to talk to the server there. Just hurry up. There we go. All right. SL comes in with, ladies and gentlemen, 12.13. 12.13 on a quarter mile. 
if you remember there was 1183 for the S55. Then we go in SLC 43 coming in with one half mile 1933. That means the SL is faster. Just saying, just saying. And the S55 coming, clocking in a time of 3060. So that means the S55 is faster than the SLC. All right, so far so good. So we got some numbers here. Interesting. So now let's let's use some of the newer times. That would be the 650i convertible on quarter mile, then the SLK Black Series on half mile and on full mile. Which one is missing? This one, obviously, the SL73. So, okay, quarter mile for the BMW 650i. We're going in with, boom, 11.93. Makes it slower than the S55, but faster than the SL73. All right, hmm, interesting. Next, we go AMG SLK Black Series coming in with 18.73. That's the fastest time so far. Fastest time. Ooh, do we get a new king? Let's see. The SL73 obviously was the highest top speed of all those cars. And clocking in a time of 31.36. Not really. Wow. Did you just realize that? The freaking S55 is better than the SL73. Just say. Just say. Oh, the SL73 only won so far on on half mile and that only against the slc Ooh, wow wow wow! we got some times here all right all right so i see so now i need to think which one is left okay so we need to uh, the slc i think which one was it this one still needs to go on a quarter mile then we got the 650i on half mile and the SLK Black Series, that will be interesting. On a full mile, oof da. Let's see, SLC. 12.16. That means it's faster than the SL73, but it's slower than the 650i, or it's slower as well than the S55. All right, so next we're going in 650i convertible, which was not bad yet. And coming in with a 1903, nice. That means it's faster than the SL73, faster than the SLC, but slower than the SLK. Whew, which does an amazing time of 1873. <laughs> wow. FLK, let's see, will he do the best time as well? So far the fastest time on half mile drag. Does he do a better time on one mile? 36, ooh, gee. crazy. That is as fast as the freaking S55. Wow, all right. We don't have a time yet for the S55 for the quarter mile and we don't have a time yet for the SLK, uh, no, for half mile. We don't have the time yet for the SLK for the quarter mile. This will be interesting. All right, so the last one, Oof, all right, so exciting. The SLK, can he beat the S55 with a freaking A11, A3, 11.83, oh man, I'm like stumbling here. <laughs> then on half mile, we still need to have a time from the S55. And on full mile, we got the 650i. This will be crazy, all right. Do we have surprises? SLK, can he beat an 11.83? Can he? 11.90! Ooh! Alright! So, we got a winner. We got a freaking winner for the quarter mile, which is the S55 so far with an 11.83. Next, being followed by the SLK with 11.90. Then next will be the 650i BMW with 11.93. Whew, we got the top three. Let's see. Top three now for half mile. Can the S55 beat the SLK? Coming home with 1850. Crazy! Are you kidding me? What a crazy number! The S55 is killing it with 1856. Next we have the SLK with 1873. 
And then, far away is the 650R, it was 1903. Wow, crazy. And now we see 650R, I don't believe the 650R is beating anyone here. But let's see, it's probably going to be third. 3163. All right, so the hmm, the 650i is actually losing it against the SL73, so there the top speed is finally winning. However, that means on place number one, we got the SLK and the S55, really surprising, with a 3060. 30 seconds and 60 milliseconds. Then next we got the SL73 finally doing a little bit on their top speed. 31 to 36 and then we got the 650i 3163. Crazy. Wow. And just to put it in comparison, yeah? Just to put it in comparison. And I mean the tomorrow is even faster. The, the freaking tomorrow is even faster. Just um, to put it here to see how does, for example, the um, Tuscan do it? Coming home, 1156, beating everyone so far. 1156, want to see, the Tuscan will beat everyone. And then the Tomorrow will beat the, the Tuscan, so if you... However, if you don't have any of those cars, you should definitely work on your S55. Next would be the SLK. Alright, coming home, 1826, beating as well everyone there, smoking everyone, Whew. And then last but not least, the one mile drag for the Tuscan convertible. It's still crazy that the S55 and the SLK is beating the SL73 on a freaking one mile drag. That is crazy, that is really crazy. But I mean, he got his freaking top speed of 196, he just never reaches it. <laughs> I don't know, he needs a... He, on the 10 mile drag, probably, I don't know. Let's see, Tuscan beating, does it... It goes below 30 seconds, I just wanted to ask that. 29.90, okay, beating everyone there. Now, um, I mentioned two other cars, which are even better. I don't know if it's better than the Tuscan convertible. But definitely one of the fastest ones is the freaking Tamora. If you got it, keep it, work on it. The moment I'm getting this, I will definitely show you the times. However, there is another contestant, which is the freaking Roof. It's a freaking Roof car. It is the Roof BTR. That's a Roof BTR, right? The Roof BTR 4381. Here we have a 5086. However, 4381, 190 top speed. This is a freaking monster as well. So the moment I'm getting this, I will let you know all the numbers. However, if you got a number, if you got the quarter mile, if you got the half mile and the full mile, drop them down below in the comment section. Come on, let's let's uh, join our forces. Let's put them, fuse them together. And so, yeah. Hope this video helped you a little bit to decide which ultra rare you should work on. Because those ultra rares are very important to get. So again, S55, SLK, those are the cars you should definitely focus on if you want to be the king. And maybe, maybe as well, if you get a second S55, I would work on it. Or a second SLK. Just in case. Just in case. Wish you a pleasant day, guys. That was the Casual Mobile Gamer.